Thanks so much. Uh, who knew that Ben Folds would open for me? Uh, but uh, I, I, used, <laughs> I used to say that uh, I worked for an arts organization, but now I refer to us as a community building organization, uh, one that uses the powerful arts as a tool to bring our community together to create a place where people want to live, work, and play. For the past decade, arts activities in our community and our schools have created a vibrancy in Morristown. We support community events where we come together as a community around music, dance, even a mass pumpkin illumination event. Businesses are moving to the area and new housing stock is being built because of this vibrancy. We're even able to get the town to adopt a percent for art program. New commercial development in Morristown is now required to invest in public art. But there's a part of Morristown in the neighborhood that streams away from the thriving downtown where our immigrant population has settled for the past century. We wanted to create a place of public art honoring all the immigrant populations that have settled there over time. And we wanted this to be monumental and permanent. So we applied to the National Endowment for the Arts for a grant to build two stone carved totems and we decided to place them right at the intersection where these two parts of Morristown meet. Right in front of the community garden, right next door to the low income senior housing, down the street from the high school, and across the street from a brand new apartment complex and a new one under construction. We were awarded $20,000 from the NEA, and the developer across the street donated $50,000, and thousands more were donated by individuals from the community. That's how it works. The totems were unveiled last November, just after election day, at a great public event attended by the entire community. Now here's the best part. With this space, we've created a creative place for the immigrant community to come together and express themselves with art from their own cultures. We got a guy. We hired a community organizer, Carlos Sotelo, a young man originally from Colombia who lives in the neighborhood who is finding artists from the community to perform music, poetry, and to display visual art at the totem site. A few weeks ago, we featured a Colombian band from the neighborhood. Some of the seniors who live next door in that senior housing were attracted by the familiar music and came on down. One older, older gentleman was so moved, now this is for real, he got up from his wheelchair to join in a song that he knew that he recognized, and to great joy and surprise of the members of the band, he joined them in singing that song. While this new program is programming is just beginning, we're beginning to see the immigrant communities in Morristown realize that this is their space, honoring their culture as, part, as an integral part of the overall vibrancy of Morristown. Thanks a lot. <laughs>